previously on Minecraft. I'm gonna name this village since it did house us. Uh, we're gonna call this place. Um. Uh, a long, long time later. Sand place one. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go through the desert. Ugh, this, where is the jungle? You see, I've been through the desert on a horse with no name. It felt good to be out of the rain. <gasps> ah! Look at it! There it is! Woohoo! Finally! I'm sorry if I blew out your eardrums, but oh my god, I've been looking for one of you. Yes! It's like the promised land. There you are. Alright. Hey, can I choke you? Can I just fucking. Drown! Yeah! <laughs> ah! Ah! Uh. In West Philadelphia. Oh, yeah. that is cool. I like that. <laughs> there we go. Boom. That's the first step. And we got vines. In fact, we're like I said, we're gonna have to chop down more because I I'm gonna need way more saplings. Okay, well, I've only cut down the first tree, <laughs> and it takes forever to cut, chop those those big ass ones down. So, what I might do is try and replant just the smaller ones. But thing is, I don't know if they drop that many saplings. Like, if I plant a tree and it drops one sapling, I gain nothing. So, uh, I'm kind of worried about the r rate of return here. Um, also, I realized that on a certain day, the don't the pillagers like kind of have patrols and since I am close to the village they're probably gonna attack these guys so what I might end up doing is before I even build my base uh, I'll just set up defenses here kind of make my first home in the village you know live learn to live with the villagers understand where they're coming from how you doing you got no profession now huh? Ooh, library Oh, that this guy does something. Who are you? You are a librarian. Curse of Vanishing. Uh, yeah, I don't have that many emeralds. I uh, sorry. Ooh, a farmer. Potatoes. Do you have any potatoes? Ooh, no, you just got wheat. Dang it. Oh, but you do have beets. Just one? Just one set of... Alright, fine. Well, uh, wait. Beetroot seeds, of course. Just replant those, I guess. And we'll trade with him. And you're the library. You two are farmers. You want that. What do you want? Carrots. Bread. Ah, you guys suck. Uh, but yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Is the pillagers are close by. I do want to make sure my guys here are protected and safe. <laughs> so, think first things first. Let's build a wall. You know, we'll become Trump <laughs> and make that wall that he want. Oh god. All right, we have plenty of sticks. It is getting dark. Um I think, what was the house that I occupied last time? Because I'm just going to sleep in there again. <laughs> I've claimed it as mine. Everyone get inside. It's getting dark. Dangerous. Jesus. That scared me. <laughs> oh, it's this one over here. I think. No one lives in here, right? Yeah, see, no one lives in here. This will be my home. And because I don't want things snaking up on me uh, during the night, I'm placing those there for now. No, not that one there. Um, and put my bed like right, right here. Good night. Oh, I left the door open. Please don't murder me in my sleep. All right, morning. Where is the shine? Hey, what are you doing out here? You 
Get out of here. Good. Oh, wait. You. No, you're not making a hole in this beautiful town. I'm not letting you. I want more, more of you bastards. No, I think you do. But yeah, we, let's set up this wall first. It's not going to be much of a wall, but... Some sort of defense. A fence. A defense fence. A fence of defense against those critters, those slime balls. Actually, I guess those guys aren't slime balls. I've been watching a lot of the A-Team, and in that, they didn't curse because it was the 80s, so they said slime balls. They didn't see, say, like, assholes or, you know, dickheads or bastards. They said slime balls. Alright, keep going. I mean, this isn't much of a defense, but it ought to do the trick. It ought to hold... Ow, cactus! Get out of here. Gotta eat my steak. Alright, all around. We're gonna make it all around the village. We're doing a little further. Yeah, the good thing about, um, having jungle trees is we're gonna get a lot of wood. And you might ask me, like, hey, why not just build it out of the logs? See, I... I get that. I, I, I get I could do that. But I want this base to be more or less all natural. So I want it to be grown. Naturally grown, uh, trees. And, uh, yeah, it'll be way nicer than whatever I could build on my own. There we go. There we go. Okay. Oh, we're, we're way past... I guess we could have a water source in here, so let's keep going. What I did is, because I needed stone tools, I needed wood, so I uh, just dug a little, a little basic mine down here just to get stone, you know, cobblestone. This will be my temporary mine, and eventually I'll shut it down, close it down. It'll be a tourist attraction for the, the villagers when they get over here. But look how much freaking logs I already have, so I might as well convert this. Nice, there's even sugar cane grown here. This is good. In fact, what I'm going to do is because I want more of this, I eventually need books. Let's start growing stuff right now. There we go. Hey, piggy. <laughs> oh, man. I swear they've added a new punch sound. That was a good, like, whack. Like, what the sh <laughs> Let's try again. No, that's the old one. I'm also making this quite large because I do want to have a good wide open space for the animals. They will all be protected within this fence. I feel wooden fence, it'll be more pleasing to the eye than a stone one, so that's why I'm going for the wood here. Hang on, I do not... What are you doing all the way out here? Get home. I do not want to fall in here, but this is a great place for resources. That's why also a great place to just set up. Um, but now I'm going to... I think <laughs> I don't want to fall in here, uh, so I'm gonna cover this or put some of this. Hey, get get in! I'm building a fence. You're gonna be outside of the perimeter. Kill him. Do it. Okay, I'm not. That, I'm not that cruel. I'm not that cruel. I was gonna do it. Would you get? All right, fine. Do you know how to get around? All right, well, hope so, because I'm I'm closing th this off. You're not getting back this way. I don't know if you know how to use fences. Or <gasps> oh, oh my god! Oh, that scared the shit out of me. Oh my god! Seriously, I like my heart skipped a beat.
Oh, Jesus. I thought I fell into the... <laughs> I thought I fell into the ravine. All right. It's fine. We're fine. Everything's fine. And look, we made it to the fence. Wrap this around so I don't do that again. Yes! Wait, we're not done yet. <laughs> but the thing is, this is honestly a t uh, very uh, natural border, so I, eventually I might block this off, but for now, I'm going to just skip this because uh, I don't want to spend all day covering this place up. Gonna go to the edge, and from here, I'm gonna bring it back. Bam! And we're done. Uh, put a torch on me. Yes! We have encased the village. We have protected it. And, uh, yeah. We're mm. safe from those pesky bad guys for now. We're coming for you, eventually. But, uh, yeah. I think we'll now just light it up a bit. I also, because I, I do want to light up within the walls so mobs don't spawn out here. Or in here, I should say. I'm not counting these. I'm sorry if, I mean, I like to be pretty precise, but for now, I'm just mm. kind of winging it. I'm not so kind to sheep. Get it? Oh, you, okay. You wanted me to fall in there. You wanted me to fall in there. You will die. <laughs> the fact that it made no noise. Long live the king. So I'm scared that I am honestly going to walk into this, so... I should probably... I'll put some torches right here. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Alright. A lot of the animals are outside, but that's okay. We'll get him back in eventually. Mark the edge of this a bit. You're gonna die. I told you to get in here. I warned you, but you didn't listen. And now look what's gonna happen. Look what's gonna. This is what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass. You see what happens, Larry? You see what happens? This is what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass. You see what happens, Larry? You see what happens? This is what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass, Larry. This is what happens, Larry. You see what happens, Larry? You see what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass? This is what happens. You see what happens, Larry? You see what happens, Larry? Do you see what happens, Larry, when you fuck a stranger in the ass? This is what happens, Larry? This is what happens, Larry? This is what happens, Larry? Although, I guess... <laughs> I fucked him. Alright. Hey, hey, hey. Over here. Keep running. Come on. Oh, shit. Go. Ah, damn it. Shoot that guy. Oh, God. I got, I got, I got a weapon. I got a weapon. Ah, uh, you fucker. You're not killing me. Ow. You might. You run inside. Run inside. Run. No! Get in here! You stupid bastard! Okay, Skellies apparently don't care about you. Get in here, I will close the gate after you if you just get your ass in here! <laughs> you. You stay the fuck back. I'm afraid of you. I'll kill you with a goddamn shovel. You hear me? I'll kill you with a goddamn shovel! <laughs> fuck! 
fucking die. Now you, get inside before I fucking murder your ass for real. Get in there. Get in there. Get, get in. Get in. Get in. Ah, oh, Jesus. You're gonna be called Larry from now on. Big Lebowski, you're Larry. This is what happens to me when you fuck me in the ass. Yeah, yeah, shut up. Oh my god. That was close. Don't you back talk me, man. Don't you even try. I will not forget this. And don't don't think I won't remember who you are. I know exactly what you look like. Yeah. Oh shit. Zombies! Yes, kill- oh my god. It's the invasion. It's happening. This is also why I wanted to- Oh, they're in- outside. Okay, that's fine. Um... Ah, uh, shit. I need a proper weapon to deal with this creeper. Uh, wait. I put a crafting bench over here. I'm gonna make a couple axes. And... Those should be good. Enough. They're not steel axes or iron axes, but they do. There's the creeper. I want to kill the creeper because it that will cause damage. It will cause damage. And I don't want to appreciate damage. You hear me? Yeah, I don't want to appreciate it. Critical strikes, bro. That's how you got to deal with them. Critical strikes. Now these torches I will just be placing haphazardly, mainly to add illumination, so mobs do not get up in here. Uh, we might as well make more tor- oh, I don't have any coal. That's alright. I guess I should sleep. I guess I should sleep. Everyone else, get inside! Everyone. You too, Larry. Get- in your house. Where is he? Ah, we'll get there. I'll take my house. Thank you very much. Nope. Damn it. Get out of here. Okay. Ow. I'm gonna die if I, uh, <laughs> uh I don't want to eat rotten flesh either. I could make bread. I'm gonna use some of your hay supplies. Oh no! No! Don't you make a hole in this village! Don't you do it. Alright, now, bread. Uh, pretty sure I need a crafting bench. Crafting table, whatever. Ooh. Oh, hi! Uh, excuse me. No! Okay, this is a bad time to be outside. I need to get back inside, but I can't sleep inside because there's a there's a skeleton outside. Oh, it's a skeleton. Okay, is he gone? It's gone. No one's outside my house. Ow! Except that guy. Shit. I know I'll spawn back in here, but I don't. I I don't want to die. <gasps> oh! Oh god, I'm dead. I'm dead. Half a heart. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. <gasps> All I need is... To get inside. I'm waiting. Close the door! No. No. I can't help you. I just need bread. Okay. Sorry to disturb you. Oh, that's the torch. Where's that guy? I don't want him to die. Alright, I'm going to sleep now. Not disturb me. Yes. Oh, that was a that was a that was close. Alright. Now the bomb's burning. I hope we didn't lose anyone. I do realize that one guy got hit. But he didn't die, right? We're still okay. Okay. And you get the fuck out of here. You don't- you guys don't- oh shit. What I need is a bow. 
because I, I, I very much prefer the bow. Some infinity up on there. Ow! How are you guys not dead? It, the sun is out. Burn! Alright. Yeah, those guys, I guess, don't burn. You know what? I don't mind if you blow that guy up. <laughs> you fucked! Alright. Hey, piggy. You saw that, right? Pretty cool. Patch up this hole. There we go, good enough. Now, getting this out a bit. Sand Place One is getting an upgrade, the Ionic upgrade. Hear ye, hear ye. I am Ionic Gecko, as I've stated in the past. I'm here to make your lives better. So, you know, trust me and you all get through this. Larry, you can fuck yourself. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, I, I just uh, have a problem with that guy. He tried to kill me. I swear. What was I even doing? <laughs> um, so I've built the perimeter defense. Oh, that's right. I could make, um, you know, here's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to go down there, get some iron. I need to make a bucket. I need to make an infinite water source. <sighs> Ooh, could I jump? I mean, I could jump down there, but I feel like I'm going to miss and break my legs and die because I'm not even at full health at the moment. I'm going to go around. Oh, and that's a hole. Oh, this this is a safe way down. This is coal. Exactly what I need. All right. Oh, shit. Get out of here. The problem is, I don't have armor. I've been doing this, playing this whole time without armor. And I probably should get armor. To be honest. <laughs> to prevent my first death. Or, per, or, yeah, I need armor. And for that, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to kill some cows. Sorry, cows. We'll make you breed. You will multiply. Cows don't die, they multiply. All right, cows, making a hole here. Come on. Where's your friends? Where's your cow buddies? Also, sheep. Sheep are welcome as well. Pigs, I'll come get you once I have some potatoes. Follow me. Follow me. I am your savior. Except that I'm leading to your, to your slaughter. All right, in here. Welcome. Welcome to Sand Place 1. Your final resting place. And living place, I guess. All right, you breed, 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 cows. Breed, 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 breed. Make babies. Make a babies. Sorry, sheep. I don't have a pot in for you at this time. Stay in there. Uh, unfortunately, any stragglers are going to be murdered. There's chickens as well. Did I see any more cows down here? Huh, guess not. Alright, never mind. No one will be... Well, when I say no one will be murdered, I mean some, someone's gonna be murdered. But you, you are all by yourself, I'm sorry. At least it was a quick death. Leather, I think I have four leather in total. I'm gonna need more. Sorry. Oh, hey, don't you come out. Don't make this harder than it has to be. That's good. I have been getting leather, though, so. Alright, five. That's enough for a helmet. Boom. I have armor. Down, 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 down. Okay, you know what? It's not that impressive. Hey, Gecko, do you want to help me, um, go mine? I would appreciate the protection. <laughs> Just don't get blown up, is all I ask. Cook this meat. Because as delicious as bread is, we're gonna, we're gonna be on a pretty meaty diet. Eventually, chickens will be our primary source of sustenance. 
Um, because I don't want to kill all the animals. I don't want to be super inhumane, but I do want to eat. Is the sun setting already? Man, the days just aren't long enough. Doesn't matter, this time I'm going in. I have armor, you see? Nothing can stop me. Were his last words before dying. Hmm, now I'm wondering, maybe I shouldn't bring you down here, because if you fall, you're gonna die, probably. Or hurt yourself real bad. And I don't want you to die, you hear me? I don't want you to die. Alright, well, in we go. We do not want to go that way. That way is bad. Hey, careful now. Don't let me, I don't want to hit you. Whoa. Being washed away. Staircase out of here. Yeah, let the water flow down. Oh, I hear some... I hear a dude... Come on, get gonna get out of there. Right. Is that skeleton above us? Ah, dang it! Oh, I hear him. There's a lot around us. The bones are clanking. Get ready, get gonna. We will be facing a battle. I'm sure of it. This water goes deep. Oh, yes! A mine shaft! Oh, man. I usually end up looking for these for, like, the longest time. And the fact that it's right under a village is perfect. This is where we will get a lot of good resources, Gekkonen. Yes? Where'd you go? Gekkonen. Oh, uh, there's cave spiders. There's cave spiders in here. No doubt about it. Gotta find them and kill them. Oh, uh, I don't like the sounds of it. I think they're up there. Just want to light this up a bit, but yeah, this is perfect, man. Mine shafts, love these. We'll come back for this. <laughs> what you doing? Get good and come on. Get your face out of there. This water is a little... It's hampering our movement, so I'm going to block it off. There. Could use more torches. There we go. But the fact that we have that mine shaft, that honestly, that is perfect. That is perfect right there, yes. Didn't ask for a better place. And this just and the fact that we have this ravine. I love ravines, they're really cool. A lot of good stuff found on the walls. Torches on the right to indicate where we've come from. And help us guide our way home. Learned all that way back in 2012. Watching Paul Soros Jr. Love his Minecraft uh, Survive and Thrive series. It's honestly one of the things that got me hyped and into the game. At first I was like, Minecraft, what is this stupid blocky freaking thing? But then after realizing everything that you can do, I honestly the graphics are just just charming to me. I mean, and obviously you can get texture packs and um, all sorts of mods to make this look game look way different from the vanilla experience that personally I enjoy. I like the way it looks, more or less. My favorite thing is just to what I like to do is to add the realistic shaders, just because then everything feels more natural, even though I know it's blocky and stuff, but still. Oh man, I should probably go up and secure the village. Kind of forgot that they are my responsibility. Sand place one will not... It, I will not let the population drop. Also, we should probably count everyone and uh, mark the population on a sign. Because we're going to grow this town 
it will be a formidable city eventually. I hope, maybe, maybe, I don't know. Alright, a lot of iron. Very good. We'll explore, go exploring later. Right now it's just resource collecting and getting that base set up as fast as possible. Also defenses, like I said, the town defenses. Those are on top of my to-do list, uh, which I'll display, my objectives. Alright, let's go. Get going and come on, buddy. Enjoy the daytime, the daylight, the sunshine. Another beautiful day in Minecraft. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna make gates. Uh, get going and where are you, buddy? Get going in. You get your ass over here, boy. Use those teleportation powers right now. Oh. Looks like we have an uninvited guest. Come on, then. There you are. For now, let us light up this place. We're gonna definitely need torches. Good stack full ought to do it. Uh, and yeah, light light all of this up. Start off with the fence. This uh, I like this uh, town because it's part. It's like right at the edge of this desert biome, and then it's also surrounded by savanna. So they do have some nice trees around here, but then they have a desert town, desert village. It's very cozy, very cool. I like it. Sand place one, you might get renamed later. <laughs> what are you doing out here, Larry? I see you. You're not you're not getting around this fence. This thing is impenetrable. You think you can escape? I don't think so, buddy. Try all you want. You're not getting out of here this time. Alright. Now the fence has been lit. I need to eat, and I... Well, I do have bread. What are you following me for, Larry? You get out of here. I'm not getting in my bread. No. Go, go. Leave me alone. Is he distracting me? I don't even know. Got what I was doing. I'll replan all this for you, uh, and then I'm going to trade... Well, that's right. I can't actually plant those. Got to plant the seeds. Some wheat. We're gonna focus on the beetroot, if that's okay, Mr. Farm Man. Yeah, because, uh, well, you need carrots, and we don't have carrots. I'm gonna have to go find carrots. Cows, it is time for breeding, because I need le I need more leather armor, I'm just saying. Come on now. Come with me. Oh, hey. You're the one that needs breeding, right? I don't know. I lost track. You and... and yes, yeah, I knew it was you. Make a baby. And there's... How many over here? Nice. Quite a few. Make a baby for me. Yes, you will. You probably... I want this to be a little bigger, so I'm taking this uh, whole back section out. I'm expanding it. It'll be like a terrace, I guess. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> hey, you you turning a page in here? See, I would love to trade with you, but uh, I don't. I have five emeralds. I'm not that rich. I have to go find more villages and trade with those guys. But those are all in future episodes. For now, smelting iron. This will be the site of your blacksmith. But I don't have any, uh, any more of that, so I'm just gonna, for now, it's just outlet. There's a way to make, like, a blast furnace, isn't there? And because I do want to keep up with my own home base project as well, I have to plant these. Plant them in here. One. Plant another one there. Two. Plant one more right, uh, right, uh, 
Get out of here. Piggy, get out of here. Oh, it's gonna kill it. Yes. Kill him, Kekkonen. and he insulted me. Thank you. Sorry, pig. Uh, honestly, didn't didn't want to, you know, sentence you to die, but uh, Kekkonen had another idea for that. But it's night time, so what I could do is light this place up. Dang it. Oh, God. Ah, I'm being chased by a tiny zombie. You know what? We're gonna end on this climax of a. Oh! Am I? Will I win this fight? Find out in the next episode. Okay, no, I, I won the fight. Oh, look at you! You're riding a chicken. Oh, that is awesome. I want to keep you. <laughs> I feel like that doesn't happen all that often. Um, how, where should I? I need to trap this guy. Yes! <laughs> I got you. Right, sit. I don't know what I'll do with you, but you need to be covered. Or the daylight will burn you. Uh, Wait, actually, daylight doesn't burn the little guys, does he? Does it? We'll, we'll find uh, out. For now, you will be under there. Alright, I'm going to sleep, and we're going to end call it quits here, people. Join me next time as I try and accomplish my objectives. <laughs> Alright, peace out. <laughs>